Hey, singer Matt Goss is celebrating 10 years in Las Vegas as a headliner, and it doesn't happen often. He has a special show mm -hmm. coming up. It includes a lot of surprises, also VIP friends and family. It's a Sunday at the Mirage. Hey, did you know it's also Matt Goss Day, declared by Clark County uh, in the Strip? And he's here with us today. I feel so honored. I feel like you, I saw you yesterday. You were <laughs> swimming in my pool. She's my mate. So yeah. We always like to reveal we are great, great friends. Yeah, uh, we're good friends. It's off air, but it's a big day. It's a huge day. It's, it's also my mum's birthday. Yeah. And when they gave me a, they, it's such a huge honor. When they gave me a, the Matt Goss the, Day, the Matt Goss yeah, day uh, thanks for reminding me. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, they didn't know it was my mum's birthday, oh. so it's, a, it's like a, it's a double beautiful day today. So. It sure is, it sure is. And I know, listen, I, you've had a great show going at the Mirage just over the last, what, year and a half, but you were at Caesars before that. Showing some video, because I love this campaign of all the Matt Goss billboards going down <laughs> the strip. This is something that you don't see often. This is the Matt Goss train right <laughs> Yeah, there. there it is, the train. Uh, but you've had a great run really in Vegas for 10 years now, and it's not something that happens often. No, I think, I mean, this town is taking me under its wing in, in, in a way that I could, un, I could never have dreamed of. My grandfather said to me once, he said, son, go and play Las Vegas. And mm -hmm. it's truly one of my dreams. And I still have to pinch myself every, every show that people st are still coming to see me. And mm -hmm. you know, this Sunday is going to be such an incredible day, uh, an incredible night. And you know, to actually uh, sing, I'm going to have friends. We've got other entertainers coming. Uh, we've got a few surprises. Um, it's going to be an incredible night. So yeah. I'm just honored to still be here, really. Yeah, it's amazing. And look at all the friends that you've made over the, the years. And some of them are old friends and new friends. But all these celebrities come to your show. You've gone to their shows uh, through the 10 years. Cher, Celine, Jerry Lewis came to your show, the late Jerry Lewis, and loved it. Jerry and, Jerry actually came and stayed for the whole show. And uh, and I said, I can't believe you you stayed the whole show. He said, I've got jo jokes longer than your show. <laughs> <laughs> so, I love it. So, you know. Yeah, and for people that may not have ever been to Matt's show, you know, live band, dancers, the whole nine, in a great kind of loungy atmosphere, we're really kind of what Vegas has always uh, used to be, and still we're trying to keep alive, aren't we? Well, the thing <laughs> for me, I just love this town so much, and as a British man, as a London boy, I, I came to this town wanting to experience the camaraderie from the entertainers and from the town, uh, Bugsy Siegel, and started the Flamingo, and then my, my time at Caesars Palace. I just want to be one of the people that hopefully encouraged to keep the glamour here and, yeah. and keep keep that in this town. It is important and when you're at the show people just really kind of they love the live music atmosphere you can't there's just something different when there's a track and a singer it's great but when you are truly immersed in this intimate you know moment that's what Las Vegas is about. Yeah it's not quite as polite as people think it's it's, it's an edgy show it's I interact with the, the audience we tell stories mm -hmm. we, we have we have you know I give away quite a lot of booze you do. in the show. Um, <laughs> I think that's pretty, probably the only reason I'm still here for 10 years because I always give away, I give away free booze. But Could be. It's one of the probably only real reasons. But the, the, the songs are good and you know, yeah. You know, I've been doing it a while now. So yeah, you've got an incredible voice. Even though we're friends, I must say, really one of the best voices I've ever. Uh, so you have to go see Matt. Wanted to quickly talk about some things you've been doing in the UK. You started out in the UK, and you have a documentary about your life out now, and it's uh, received BBC Moment of the Year, a BAFTA Award, a National uh, Film Award for Best Documentary. The list goes on. We've got a little clip of the uh, trailer itself. We kind of turned the volume down because um, you know there's some of the moments are very intense. There's a few profanities. I mean, the reality is. Uh, uh, music is ver music industry is a very tough place. We have sold millions and millions of records, and to go back and play stadiums, we just played. You know, we play arenas, we play stadiums, and then to come back and learn so much from Vegas, um, it's a beautiful contrast. Sometimes it's difficult to go and play those big venues and come back and do such intimate shows, but I learned so much, and this town continues to teach me. Yeah, I mean, uh, this film has uh, been called by like I think it, what was it, Radio GQ. Times. Huh. GQ, GQ, the, GQ the, the, greatest, the greatest music documentary of all time, and yeah. it's incredible. Yeah, it's taken off. It's gone viral in England. Uh, you can get it here as well, rented on Amazon and iTunes too, and right? iTunes, Apple TV, all that. It's all available. So I'm very, very proud of it. Yeah, you've done such great things. Listen, happy 10-year anniversary. Happy mm -hmm. Matt Goss Day. Enjoy your day. And Thank everyone you. come out to the show Sunday, 8 p.m. If you want to be a part of the fun, you can head to the Mirage website. There it is on your screen and get tickets. And Matt will be here. We're hoping for another 10 years. Are we doing lunch today? Maybe. <laughs> you keep asking the question.